Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenra, and today we are playing Granada here in the Open of Rosales 4. It's, uh, well, 1505, so it's been 61, 62 years, no, 61 years since the start of the game, and we've made a lot of progress. I like this. This is definitely going better than my attempts uh, when we stayed in Europe. Staying in Europe is just rough. Oh, shoot. Why didn't I... Uh, let's go ahead and take the bulb here for the last diplomatic idea group. Unjustified demands are cheaper. Hooray! Then also gives us a free CB. Oh, that doesn't. No, we already had the free CB. Right. Free CB against other government types, but there are no merchant republics around here. There is going to be Tibet with their theocracy, so we'll be able to declare war on them. But other than Tibet, there's nobody really around that we can use that CB on. That's more of a European thing. Anywho, we are one third of the way into cheaper techs. That, that'll be nice. And uh, we'll have to start thinking about what we want for the next idea group, because we are going to get um, Tech 7 admin at some point here. <laughs> Not yet, though. In any case, uh, let's continue on. We took a new vassal, Barar, and we were looking at starting a war with VJ, because why not get a new va- I think we may just annex Nepal. Hmm. Yeah, we'll probably just annex Nepal. What's the culture up here, anyway? Punjabi, Nepali, Nepali, Nepali. I think we'll just annex them. Anywho, onward. Do we want to declare war on VJ right now, or do we want to wait a bit? He's got 16 guys in the north. And how many total? 41,000. He has 41,000 dudes. Are you shitting me? With tech 5. We're at tech 7. I can't believe he has 41,000. I'm going to build some cannons. Fuck yeah, cannons. Just four. Start with four. Let's see, ten and four, eight and three. Yeah, we'll probably just delete two soldiers, and we'll put some cannons. Two, two cannons in each army. We are annexing Bamanis. Oh, my poor... My poor vassal Balochistan, he has to go all the way home. It's a long walk for him. Kandesh entered a coalition against us. Really? So it's you and Delhi, huh? Yeah, Delhi and Kandesh. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. Oh, you have a core of Bamanis, don't you? You do have a core of Bamanis. Really? I think I would like to go take that. Hmm. But it'd be a coalition war. Nope. Get relations up. Let's see if we can get them out of the coalition. I didn't expect to be able to do anything to them, but I guess we can take them, yeah. Hmm. Very interesting. Uh, yeah, come back from them. Don't worry about them. Let's get our cannons up, and then we'll declare war. I can't believe he has 41,000 guys. That is amazing. What ideas did he take? He took uh, religious. And yet somehow he can support 41,000 guys. I mean, my limit is 27. And he's got 41. <laughs> That's amazing. That is just amazing. Alright, a couple more days. There we go. Okay, pause. Get a couple more armories building. Or one, whatever. And yeah, I'll delete two soldiers. Just so we're not over the limit. And give me the two cannons over there, and two cannons down here. Great. We'll go rape Nepal, nice and early in the war. And why don't you go chill in, I don't know, Mandu? We'll have to fight those 27 guys somehow. Let me turn the checkbox on. 4102, yeah, I'll keep the crappy guy up here. So. 
Do we declare war on you, or do we declare war on VJ? I think we'll declare war on VJ. Okay. Let's go, baby. And turn the speed down to three. Let Nepal enter the war. Come on, Nepal. There you go. Kick his ass. And hopefully my allies will come join me. They should. Yeah, they're coming to follow me. Good, good, good. Let's meet up in Markoshal or whatever it's called. Hopefully you should crush really quickly here. I'll get a couple... I should get a couple mercs to siege. A couple mercs for sieging. Oh, I can't afford the fourth one. Oh, well. Level two, level two. Yeah, I'll need four mercs up there. So I don't want to have to keep my regular army here. All right, let's get relations back up with the Timmies. Yeah, 82 is a little low. Keep them super happy. He is not even moving. Weird. Wow, are you not going to crush? Wow, he didn't crush. Look at that. Nepal actually survived the first attack. Wow. Alright, he seems to want to attack my vassal. Can I get there before the vassal gets attacked? Yep, it'll be fine. Let's go to Dahundar. We'll meet up there. And you can come as well. Please? There you go. Uh, let's do some war taxes. There we go. Gain piety. I like piety. Oh, my navy's going to get destroyed again. Whatever. I don't really care. I don't really have a navy, so to speak. Yeah, we should have a nice big battle here. That's about half of his force. He'll have... Yeah, he has more. But this is about half of it, and I would like to smash him up. Uh, why don't you come down and take out some of these smaller armies? Looks good. Are we going to start taking loans here? I don't think so. Um, let's boot you. We don't need that right now. Well... Yeah, we don't need that right now. We have tons of reputation. We're annexing so fast. Okay, yeah, we're going to catch him. Good. We have better morale and better tactics. That should be pretty easy. Oh, it looks like he actually wants to group up in Dobe. All right, we'll stay up here then. He's he's not splitting up his units anymore. Darn it. Okay, now he's splitting up again. Okay, let's go to Bidar, and then we'll go to Bijapur. That'll work. And you can go to Telangana. Pick the advisors. Just for now. So I want to get one more mercenary to help siege up here. Oh, this is my shitty 0-2 general, but... What are you going to do? We have great tradition, but we got a shitty... No, give me a better general. 4-2... Fine. I'll kick the zero two. <laughs> Why can't you give me a two four? Give me the shock, damn it. Oh well. Alright, 
please squish? Yeah. I love fighting these little stacks that try to siege because they're just so easy to squish. They don't have the the numbers to really make a difference against us. Now that we have cannons, we're just unstoppable. Kill him. Yeah, squish, squish, squish. Oh, he's running away. Don't run away. Ooh, I might catch him. Yeah, I think we're going to catch him. Okay. Squish, please. Oh, yeah. We just squished 10k guys. Ah, ah, I love it. So that's going to cut into his army. What do you have? He's down to 17 guys. So that's his full army now. Nice. Let's see if we can't squish him flat. Another army squished. Yeah, another 3k gone. Alright, let's go chill in Reicher. Reicher Doob. Catch him there. Good, good. Squish, please. Good, good. Oh, you really are taking a long time to walk to Rai Salima. Wow. Why are you not in Rai Salima yet? Holy shit, that took like four months to walk there. Are you kidding me? Not even kidding me. Big battle. Squish? Whoa, we just squished 12 plus 5, 17,000 guys. BJ now has 3k. Ah, I love it. Alright, uh, let me turn off the checkbox. Oh, I can't, can I? There we go. Right, I'm going to send people home. And you guys can, I'll let my vassal siege because I don't need to. Great. Can I get one more Merc? Yeah, there you go. This war will definitely bring a bigger coalition. Which is unfortunate, but not the end of the world. Alright, put the speed up. Just let my vassals do their thing. Free diplomat. Uh, maybe Ottomans? Yeah. Wow, the Ottomans are making quick work of the Mamluks. Look at that. Wow. Wow. And he's still at war with Muscovy. And he's now winning the war against Muscovy. Really? Is it from battles? Oh, the, the defender controls Yedison. But it's being sieged right now. By Ostrakhan. So that's not going to last very long. Milan, Ulis, Mantua, and Modena. Oh, wow. Savoy won a war against Milan somehow. Ah, because he's allied with some strong people. France is losing a war to Austria? Really? Yeah, France is losing horribly. Wow. France, why you so suck? What the hell, France? Why you suck?
All right, the next time we attack Delhi, it'll also put us at war with Bengal, which is okay. I'm sure we can beat them. If we can beat VJ, we can beat anything, really. At least in India. What is this? Malabar. Ooh. Yup. Malabari Conquest of Vinod. Go Malabar. Yeah, nice. Because then we can attack Malabar and just vassalize them rather than having to fight two separate wars. Timurids have a regency, which is not allowed. So every time it says Timurids have a regency, it means they just change dynasty, essentially. Oh, God damn it! VJ finished his annexation of Miwar. I waited too long. I waited too long to declare war. And the Timurids broke their alliance with us. Why? I have no idea. They're still cordial, but they broke the alliance anyway. So, oh well. That does suck, though. I mean, it, okay, now he's hostile. Now the Timurids are suddenly hostile. Dynasty change, now I'm hostile. Okay. Whatever you say, Timurids. Chagtai wants an alliance. Well, uh, I'm not sure you would be of any help against the Timurids, really. Timurids have 56,000 motherfuckers. Chagatai has 21. No, you wouldn't be much help against the Timurids. Not really, anyway. Hmm. Let's see. Uzbek, Karakoinlu, and the Mamluks all hate the Timurids, but I'm not sure if that's really much of anything. Hmm. What can we do about the Timmies? I don't know. That's like the fourth time they've broken our alliance. Chagtai, I don't really want that alliance. I'm sorry. You're just not going to be of any help. Ah, why don't you start sieging up over here? I like that Bamanis is sieging up the provinces that he wants because he has cores on them. It's kind of neat. Almost done with our core in Kashmir. That's nice. Alright, now the question is, do we annex Nepal? I think the answer is yes. Bye, Nepal. That does piss off everyone. Actually, only eight aggressive expansion against Bengal. 54 on Delhi. 50 on Kangra. Okay, so yeah, 50 on some people, but for the most part, it wasn't that big of a deal. Get that revolt risk down, baby. If you can. <laughs> uh, let's put one of our armies up there. Okay, let's start seeing what's going to be available through VJ. I want you to give land to my vassal. He, of course, will. What else can we make you do? Can we make you... Oh, he can do Gujarat. Okay, that's what we'll do. We'll make him release Gujarat. Then we can just go vassalize Gujarat. Okay, Kashmir has finished coring. Very nice. And we may want to consider converting the culture because... Uh, it will never be accepted. Kashmiri just will never be accepted. But mm, one province, it's probably not that big of a deal. It just means we don't get as much tax or manpower, but eh.
Can we get a missionary guy? An inquisitor? Yeah, we can. Okay. Get him. Convert things faster. Ooh, piety. I like piety. Sure. What can we use our free diplomat on? Um, why don't we get Arissa to like us? I mean, I plan on vassalizing him at some point, but for now, make him like us. Why not? Make sure he doesn't join the coalition. We don't need anyone else in the coalition. We don't need the t t Timurids in the coalition. Stupid coalitions. Could just make him release Miwar, I guess. Nah. I would like to go to war with Kandesh to get this province for my vassal before before we annex him. I'm just not sure how likely that is, you know? Because of the coalition. But I guess a coalition isn't the end of the world. Get him, Bamanis. Oh, Hadoti finished. Move on. Get him, Bamanis. You can do it. Oh, he's failing. Damn it, Bamanis. You suck. I hate you forever now. Okay, we've maxed relations here, and he's still pissy. We have enemy of enemy, and I don't really want an alliance, so I don't know. Maybe he'll just magically leave the coalition? Probably not. Do I have a CB on you? I need a CB on you. Let's find out. I do not. Can I get a CB? I cannot get a CB. Do you want a loan? He does not want a loan. Well, I guess we'll have to attack Delhi then. But that will bring in Bengal. Oh, that would be a much bigger war than I want. Let's see. Bengal, 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 Bengal. 28k and Delhi, Delhi, Delhi. 14k. So... 42,000 guys. It's essentially like fighting Vijayanagar again. You know, that's not what I want. I mean, the war with Delhi is very straightforward. I want him to release Punjab, because that would be half of his land. That's all I want. And the war with Bengal, I don't even know what I want with that. Could make him release Garjit. That would be five base tax. And he really has no other cores here other than Coach. Ah, a Rockin? Maybe. But yeah, I we can make him release Garget, I guess. I wish I had a CB on Kandash. I just don't. How disappointing, you know? How very disappointing. Oh well, continue the war. Um, actually, I might be able to peace out. Not yet. We're close, though. We're very close to piecing out. Okay. Discovered Bhutan and Kamdo, so we can see Tibet now. Hey, hello, Tibet. Oman changed alliances from Hedges to Haasa for who knows what reason. Okay, there we go. Okay, and Gujarat's happy because we released them in peace. 
Oh, god damn it. Look at this. Gujarat is Hindu. I fully expected them to be Sunni. But they're Hindu. Are their provinces Hindu? Yeah, that's what's going on. So Gujarat, even though he starts the game as Shiites, he never converted his fucking provinces. You lazy man, you never converted your land. Wow. Oh well. Uh, go home. I guess. Alright, and Bamanis is going to continue to annex. Uh, he has one more core up here that I would love to get, but I really don't have a way to get into war with Kandesh. I can't fabricate a claim on him. He's not a different government type, or else we would have that automatic CB. Here, let me delete the mercs. Hmm. Yeah, I don't see anything we can really do against Kandesh. I guess we can just forget about it. We'll go vassalize him later or something. I mean, there's no rush. It hasn't even been 100 years yet. We're doing pretty well against India. Oh, Malabar did finish annexing Vinod. Can we get a CB on you? Nope. Damn it. I guess we can after we annex uh, Bomanis. Maybe? No, because we won't share a sea tile. Oh, god damn it. Mysore, Mysore, Madurai, Karnatic, Madurai, Karnatic. No, what is that? Oh, Madurai. Okay, so three Madurai provinces, two Karnatic provinces, two Mysore provinces, uh, Ceylon, Kaladi, and then one province that's only VJ. But other than that, he has a lot of little nations that can be spat out. Hmm, I guess we could get a CB on Golconda once we annex Barar, but... So that might work. Alright, well, when can we next Burar? Six years from now. Yeah. I guess. I guess we can wait. There's no real rush. Could we get a diplomat or something? Yes. Whatever. Get whatever. <laughs> Keep on converting. But we are out of time for this episode today. Thank you guys for joining me. I have been Shen. You have been you. This is the Greater Grenada Empire. Uh, our royal marriage with the Timurids, uh, we're guaranteeing them as well. And, uh, yeah, marriages with the Ottomans, the Timurids, and Bengal. Mm, unfortunately, the Timurids broke our alliance, and they're hostile, because whatever. They just had a dynasty change, and now they're hostile for some fucking reason. We have no aggressive expansion. They simply don't like us anymore. I don't know. I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.